those rebels, patriots, have been there for 60 years, pretty much, doing nothing. I wonder, have I got a leader that can... Ah, I can't afford that. That's a shame. If he'd have been a plus, a plus one, I'd have had that. Ah, well. <laughs> yes, that, that's... It's also part of the achievement ferret is uh, to hold the cape, so that is where I'm headed for. Right, let's mothball that lot again, there's just no point paying for it. Ah! New idea group. Alright people, which idea shall we take? My diplomatic ideas are way behind at the moment, so I, I I wouldn't mind avoiding those to catch back up. I think I currently have a, a, a focus on admin, which I could stop. So I could either focus into Diplo and go for another one. And that would possibly allow me to do influence ideas, which would be useful for things like that diplomatic annexation cost minus 25 lower aggress aggressive impact diplo reps all that sort of stuff that one's tempting innovative is always tempting voodoo prestige decay costs technology costs down humanist is awesome Religious unity, lower un unrest, tolerance of heretics, nationalism down, except culture threshold. That is tempting. I could do expansion. Uh, I have the money probably to do three colonies at a time. Of course, my other option is possibly religious. I don't think I don't rate economic, so I think. Okay, people, I think the choices are innovative, humanist, expansion, or possibly influence or trade. I. Trade would be interesting. Humanist is good for the minus 10. Totally agree. And the minus 2 un unrest would be very useful. Naval ideas. Yeah, it's tempting. I mean, I'm not likely to run into the Europeans for a while, so I think I can hold off on naval ideas. I need something that's going to help me short term. And yeah, I agree. I don't think trade is necessary just yet. Influence would potentially be quite strong. Yeah, minus 10 nationalism is good. That's a point. I can't look at policies just yet.
naval ideas to try and westernize it. The naval ideas themselves won't actually help me reach them. It's the colonizing that will help me westernize because I've got to get to them. And I'm already colonizing. Is there one that gives me reduced coring costs? Don't think there is. Diplomatic annexation cost minus 25 might be useful. I'm going to be taking a lot of disparate people in, especially over here, so actually the culture, I, that might be a good way to go. If I'm going to go to war heavily over here, I'm going to be taking in a lot of different cultures. Core creation cost minus 25%. Ooh, that's interesting. But is the rest worthwhile? I'd say humanist, personally. I think the core cost down to... Uh, the idea of cost minus 10, useful. Culture ties, very useful. He is a nationalism. Yeah, let's go humanist. Because uh, very shortly I'm going to be taking on some very interesting cultures and I need to be able to control them. And the minus 10 to national nationalism is very useful too so we'll do that and it will give me a chance to catch this back up oh nice to see you back time four haven't seen you for a while buddy and I've just noticed how many people are uh, watching pleasure to have you all here this stream will probably be going on till about five today my five uh, GMT um, as I'm off out for today, uh, this evening, but I will be back on tomorrow. If you haven't watched this stream before, welcome, welcome. Uh, do consider a follow as this is going to be an interesting campaign. Uh, if you've been here before, welcome back. Uh, I'm happy for lurkers, time for. It's just a pleasure to have you all here. Turn Ponti P Pontianac into a city, well that's going to happen anyway, so we'll do that. No to what? Beck Geowalethic or whatever, it, however you pronounce that. Ah, Boina rose up and I caned it. Excellent. Oh, jeez. And again. Let's hope this isn't a wave of this place getting super aggressive, because they can eat troops. Do, 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 do. Right, how long am I in a Regency for? Now another five years. Okay. Yep, yeah, this is what I'm thinking, Voodoo. Haha. <laughs> 
do, do, do. Right, I reckon I've got a f All right, 1.6 and ooh, okay, that one's over take. Right, I'm gonna have a major uprising shortly. Hmm, that sucks. Mojo Jo, Mojo Jo Jo. I chose humanist. Do do do. Ah, why am I still doing that? Right, let's get Bengal liking me, because I may need them. Jeez, Pasaya really... alright. I may have to do a war with, with Pasaya before too long. So let's get ready. Alright, this war this uh, uprising is imminent. Let's see what I can do. One point six one Hmm. I wanna put them out of sync, really. Pasai will have lots of heavies. Oh, do they? Let's have a quick look. Navy, Pasai. Do, 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 do. No heavies. So I got plenty to deal with them. Oh, and they're also having an uprising, so that's perfect. That's not what I need. Um, ooh, that's closer than I would have liked. Nobles demand. Yeah, accept the demands. I was going to say, I didn't think I'd notice them having heavies. Oh crap. I'm going to lose this at this rate. I cannot afford to put any more troops there. Yeah, I know I can attack the natives, but... Let's wait for this lot to build back up. Free thinkers not persecuted. Idea cost minus 10. Excellent. 